Hi everybody, James from Excess Karting and now we are going to work, walk through putting our engine onto the chassis, um, connecting the chain and clamping it in place. So, as we already discussed in previous videos, we have offset mount and a normal mount. This one is offset. Now you'll be able to see these two holes there and there. This is what we're going to use once the engine is on the chassis, like so. We'll be using these clamps through those holes to secure the engine in place from underneath. Now, before we do that, we'll need the chain attached to the engine and we'll need to ensure that the engine and the sprockets are aligned. So, as you can see here, I have pre-aligned it, but in this instance, what we've had to do is flip the clutch around. Now, the, cl the clutches can work in both directions. So if I should leave that one there to show you and then show you this one here. As you can see, the clutch drums are the opposite way around and that's perfectly fine to do in order to make sure you've got the right level of clearance to make sure that you can get the sprocket aligned. So in this instance, we flip the clutch. So we've aligned this sprocket and at the point of alignment, there is a bolt down here, which you can get an Allen key to once you're happy that they're aligned. In order to align them, what you would normally do is run a straight edge um, or some kind of straight metal surface along the sprocket and ensure that it just runs inside so that you've got alignment on both sides of the sprocket there. So as you can see, that's nice and straight, okay? So before we go to clamp, what we'll do, we'll run the chain around the front and rear sprocket. So always start the engine all the way back so that you've got plenty of room to move. Then what I normally do is just slide the engine forwards like so, have a little fiddle with the chain to make sure it's okay. And then you'll get underneath, you'll need an eight mil Allen key and you'll apply it into those holes in the bolts and connect the engine down. Now at the point when you lock the engine down, your chain tension will change, but there'll be another video on that on explaining chain tension. But essentially once you've got to this point, your sprockets aligned, the chain's on and the engine's clamped down, essentially you fitted the engine. All right guys, any questions, please put them in the chat.